President Trump announced today that he will not attend the inauguration of President-elect Joe Biden on January 20th. It's another example of how he does not follow in the footsteps of other U.S. presidents. As Catalan's Tom Hansen shows us, once President Trump leaves office, it's likely his power will be greatly diminished, especially internationally. I know you are disappointed, but I also want you to know that our incredible journey is only just beginning. President Trump is looking to the future as he is less than two weeks away from leaving the most powerful position in the world. Anytime a president leaves office, there is a transition, adjusting to life without the immense responsibility and power the office brings with it. We can look at previous presidents of the United States who sometimes were even better former presidents than they were presidents that they were able to have this moral authority. The whole world says, wow, we need more of that. George W. Bush, for example, created the Bush Institute and the Global Health Initiative and has focused on helping North Koreans who've been lucky enough to escape from that country. Since I've been out of politics... Jimmy Carter is seen as a guardian of the free and fair elections around the world, a champion of Habitat for Humanity, and has served as a diplomat of sorts for U.S. human rights causes around the world. Political science experts don't believe Trump will have the same influence. Professor Tim Shorn specializes in international studies. And I've watched leaders around the world as they have uh, been in office and have had obviously the ability, whether it's a chancellor of Germany or a prime minister of Israel or prime minister of the U.K., that they have had influence while they were in office. But it wasn't because of them personally, it was because of their office. We're going to see something like that with President Trump. His America First philosophy and his role in the violence at the U.S. Capitol will leave him with very little influence on the world stage. Tom Hansen, Kelloland News. To give you an idea of Trump's current international standing, according to a Pew Research Center survey, people in 13 developed countries have more confidence in Russian President Vladimir Putin and Chinese President than they do in President Trump.